Hello again, everyone. Welcome back to Crusader Kings 2. We are playing as a Byzantine Empire, working to restore the Roman Empire. So let's go ahead and uh, get back into it. Um, now, I think that since Rome is a uh, one of the Pentarchs, uh, I think if I'm going to excommunicate this guy, I need to do it now. So let's go ahead and do so. And i got to wait for him to uh, finish that. So let's go ahead and unpause. Let time go. You've agreed to do that. Okay. Can I imprison you? Okay. That is fine. I'll, I'll deal with that. And can I request excommunication of you? Recently requested an excommunication. Yeah, so that's why. Alright, well, I can get a new spy master now. I guess for now it can be you. So, I am a good orator, so I get plus 10. So there's that. That's probably because my diplomacy. It, it's kind of confusing, some of this stuff. Like, uh, you know, he is virtuous. I like him. Some, like, some people will have he is brave, and other people won't. Or, um, let's see. I like power. Because you're voting for yourself. It was not to be ruled by a child. He has a severely injured trait. Oh, hey. He does. And he's also infirm. Alright, so like... No, that's going for Abkhazia. That's got going for Abkhazia. Okay, never mind. All right, whatever. Oh, now, oh yeah, okay. So they, a lot of people are going for Abkhazia now. Mm. Uh. No, nope, not doing it. It's not happening. And I've gained the Mystic Trait. Uh, doo -doo 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 -doo. Nope, not right now. I can delve into the classics. Sure. Um, focus your studies on Roman strategy, Roman law, Roman politics. Let's go for Roman strategy. Don't know what exactly what this will do. You are going over here to take care of these jerks. Let's just go ahead and assault all of this. go. Let's go up there and hit that army. <laughs> Pope's up in Bulgaria now. And the Pope is surrendering. Excellent. all of those things. 
Alright, he is already excommunicated, so I can give out these things. We did not get those two, but that's okay. Actually, can I, uh... Yeah, I can grant independence to you. Commander has improved. Very good. All those guys have left. Uh, vassal levy, true levy penalties are not too bad at the moment. I captured this bishop, so let's go ahead and ransom him. Take his 25 gold. Oh, and uh, this mayor. Ransom him. for temple there. In these past months, I've immersed myself in the fragmented accounts of uh, Kaisar's military exploits against the Gauls. It has been an enlightenment enlightening learning experience, and I am sure that, despite the difference in equipment and sizes, I can apply some of his tactics against my own enemies. My studies have paid off. I get uh, Kaiser Insights, giving the following effects. Marshall plus two. Very nice. <clears throat> Pope is uh, set up right here. All right, let's go ahead and give you... Oh, oh. I'm going to risk it. No, I guess I'll go for learning. I hate Idolizer. Don't turn out crappy. Maybe I'll go for you instead. <laughs> I captured this bishop again. Actually, I'll just go down to... Orvieto. Any other uh, prisoners? I do have some others. I was in the county of Avalonis. Oh, like I care about that. She's so insignificant. Let's behead a nine-year-old girl. It's kind of terrible. The King of Pictland wants my daughter. Uh, this daughter is not bad, so I'm going to say no to that. For some uh, decent people. Ah, genius. Perfect. And you need a uh, husband. Again, matrilineal. Uh, let's go for this, uh, this quick kid.
There we go. Now we're at 100%. Offer peace. Enforce demands. <clears throat> Very tempted to just destroy the Kingdom of Bavaria. Uh, it's not going to really get us anything because we can go to Holy Wars against uh, Pannonia if we want. Surf this one? Okay. Interesting. I don't know why I was able to usurp it. Alright. Um, revoke the Kingdom of Bavaria. The vassals will not object. And if I execute you, this guy would inherit, which is not ideal. So can I revoke that? Yep, I can. Can I banish you? Uh, no, but I can ransom you. I'll do that. Okay, now can I banish you? Yes, I can! No one will care, and I'll gain 220 gold. Yeah, it's good times. Okay, this land should be a properly a Greek. Let's load up my filters. Alright, Gabriel. That is Pavia. I'm kind of tempted to uh, take this away. Um, succession type is not Gavelkind. Crap. Uh, can I change that? can. Now I can destroy it. All de jure vassals of the Kingdom of Bavaria will be upset. That will cost me 400 prestige. That is fine. I have destroyed the title at Kingdom of Bavaria. Now I don't have to worry about that. We've got these lands uh, under our control, and that's the important thing. Uh, I'm going to transfer vassalage of this guy, Ravenna. There we go. Pavia. Not Epirus, not Karen. Let's go down to the bottom. That's probably where everything is. <coughs> Corsican, not yet. Uh, actually, yeah, we can do that. Vieto, yep, you can have that. Hmm. Can I transfer these other things, though? That is... Lamberto. Nope. Okay, what about... Addo. 
No. Why not? It's kind of annoying. Oh! No. Ah, yes, he does have the kingdom of uh, the papacy. That's why I cannot do that. Okay. Huh. Can I usurp that? Merchant republics and patricians cannot usurp kingdoms or empires. Right, no, I can't usurp it because, uh... I am... It's, it's a... A thing with the imperial. Although, I don't know why it's saying... Merchant republics and patricians, but whatever. <coughs> I'm not sure what would happen if he... Loses this. Alright, well... What about Latium? I can create that. I will do so. That will be mine. Um, eventually I will want to get that back. The Prince Bishop... Right, right. Orbitello. I'm thinking of uh, Orvieto. Bishop Kabir and a Barony. Oh. Oh, that's not going to be good. That's going to be a problem. Because that'll mean that the uh, the Papal States will be uh, sticking out free. Okay, uh, that will probably mean that I'm going to have to like revoke this or something like that eventually. Um, I can't excommunicate him, but maybe he won't convert when I redo the... when I mend the schism. And this guy, he will not convert right now. Maybe later. Maybe his uh, heir will. We'll see how that goes. Okay. All right. So we've got all. We've got Ferrara now, and we are one war away from Latium. So that's good. Uh, we still need this, but we also need to take care of this guy. Acceptance score. All right, let's see. Why is why does me being zealous get a minus ten? So because this guy has the same culture as me, that's cutting it down a little bit. He has a lot of piety. He's diligent. He is kind. Basilius Constantinos VI has influence over the College of Cardinals, plus eight. What? What? That's weird. Um, okay, the Ecumenical Patriarch's opinion of me is not very high. Uh, he is infirm, so there's that. But I could try giving him... Dislikes new obligation law. What did I... What What happened? D did you guys... Did they pass this and I didn't realize it? I don't know. I think it might have been the... Uh, the inheritance change for, um, whatchamacallit. Alright, well, what if I... How much money do you want? If I gave you a, uh, a gift. Fifteen gold. Now will you do it? Yep, you'll do it. Air again. 
Okay, you have been excommunicated. How many uh, troops do you have? That many? I'm going to wait until my uh, troops arrive. <coughs> my retinue arrives. Can I get any more retinue? Nope, I'm still over the retinue cap. Need a new Sacalarios. Uh, you can be Sacalarios, or you can be Sacalarios. I'd like you be Sacalarios. Album of Salerno, that's fine. <coughs> Widespread rumors say that ecumenical patriarch Alexios II leads a most wicked lifestyle, quite unsuitable for any priest, and even more so for one in his exalted position. We must pray for his eternal soul. Okay. Italy has expanded a little bit. That's okay by me. Although this is your personal land, which is not great. You created the Duchy of Friuli. It's also not great. Wait, no, we do want to hold feast. Try and become just. Let's perform at my feast. Common interests bind us together. Be perfect for my feast. Uh, what are you doing? Okay, no. Nothing I need to worry about. Uh, something else I was going to look at. Right, someplace else that I could build a building. Build another temple. wonder why this isn't showing up there. Alright, let's see what we get. Hereby invite you. I don't like you either. Don't like you either. Welcome to my feast. Come on, just. Come on, just. <coughs> I'd like to show you uh, the castle, especially in my bedchamber. Sure, why not? Yet another victim has fallen to my murderous whims. As I look down at the corpse on the floor, I realize that I have managed to uh, stack quite a considerable body count by now. Soon enough, one of my guards brings me back to the matters at hand, asking me what should be done with the remains. Put it somewhere I can see it. 5% chance that I gain the trait Lunatic. I will be known as Ironheart. Become known as a founder of Bloodline. Ooh. No. Make it disappear. Arrest chance. Dang it! It's because I've murdered so many people. I don't want this one. I hate this one. You can add executed prince, uh, prisoners to the uh, macabre banquet. Vassal opinion minus six. I cannot afford that. I guess I'll take the arrest chance plus 10%, even though I don't want arrest chance plus 10%. Like, both of these are bad, in my opinion. <clears throat> the Silent Killer of Constantinople. As unassuming and welcoming as Constantinople's palace might look on the outside, few visitors enter it without a heavy feeling of dread clouding their minds. The manor of the Basilius of the Byzantine Empire has become quite infamous for swallowing its guests without much warning. Nobody has ever found proof of the Basilius's misdeed, or ever heard him order an execution. 
Are you sure about that? Yet all of his enemies have the alarming tendency to disappear in mysterious circumstances and never be heard from again. Nothing ever happens around here. I wish I had more choices in the matter. Can restore reputation. So... Obfuscate. Has intrigue greater or equal to 8? Uh, has a trait kinslayer. Familial kinslayer. Dynas dyna uh, dynastic kinslayer. Tribal kinslayer. Known murderer. Vicious rumors. Scandalous mur rumors. Okay, so those are okay. But I would much rather have the builder one. The builder one is so much better. There, there's a bunch of builder ones, and they're so much better. You can get, like, National Tax Modifier. I mean, it, it's like plus 1% or something like that, or plus 10% maybe. So it's not that high, but it's still so much better. I didn't want that one. <clears throat> I mean, we have a bloodline at least. We have a 1% chance of success. Wow. Where is my plus 10%? Well, I am sitting on your capital right now. Um, I don't know that I need any of you, to be perfectly honest. Or you... I don't know that you were independent. <clears throat> sword from heaven. A sword made of metal that fell from the sky. Some say it was a gift from God. I want that. Blessed Carl of Retz. Blessed Carl of Retz. I mean, this is Carl of Retz. I don't see the blessed trait. Maybe he was blessed before he converted to uh, Orthodox? I don't know. Whatever. You guys will uh, all move in eventually. There was an army of the Thracian revol revolt up there. Bishop Anastasios of Romilly has usurped the title Bishopric of Romilly from uh, Theodoric. Okay. Just work on uh, getting that. Oh, that's up there. All right. How is uh, Merovingian doing? Eh, he's got a lot of family. Got a lot of family. Not converting, though. <coughs> okay, let's bring you over. Let's get in there so that they can't come through. Son was born to my stuttering son, who is Catholic. Not a fan. Let's see. You do have 6,000, but uh, it's not going to be an issue. Your vassal exarch Theophylactos of Greece is arguing with his wife. I should totally intervene. He seemed very grateful for my help and promised to return the favor whenever possible. Oh, hey, he owes me a favor. He is my advisor, so I can call that in. Get him to uh, vote on something that I want. 
at some point. That's a lot of pressure. Ooh, I can ride a magnum opus. Uh, let's brew a potion of eudaimonia first. I'll add twice as much lemongrass. I feel different. Lighter! Uh, I do not have enough to write a uh, magnum opus. Pretty close. Yeah, so... Let's check in August. Yeah, there we go. Write a magnum opus. Do it! However, it is about time to uh, call it an episode. When we come back next time, we will see what we can do about uh, um, uh, taking Anatolia. Um... I think what I will do, since my only real goal here is, uh, I'm, I'm just going to toss him in jail once, uh, once I'm able to take the kingdom of Trebizond. I think what I'll do with Trebizond is I'll give it to these guys up here or something, because th that one I don't want to destroy. Bavaria, no one, uh, no one cared, so it didn't really matter. Uh, but uh, Trebizond, I I will do so. And this is something that I've been worrying about, like, up here. They, they could make Brittany or something like that, and that's uh, something I'm a little bit worried about. And I can't create them and sit on them like I did in the last, uh, in the uh, Jade Dragon campaign. Unfortunately. Anyway, uh, when we come back next time, we'll wrap up the war with Anatolia. Uh, we will definitely consider a war against our uh, good friends down here, the Abbasids. Uh, although they do have a lot of troops and they'll have even more. So that could be kind of dangerous. <clears throat> but uh, we will need to do it eventually. So we'll, uh, we'll definitely be thinking about it. Anyway... Uh, that will be later. See you then, everyone.